So this is what I do at work, boys and girls. Most boys. This is the machine I work on. These are the things it does, right? You can pause it and watch it if you want. But this is the machine I'm on. There it is. I totally forgot, I've already started looking for a bomb here. So basically I've got a, a grid to cover this area. Up and down, up and down. It's all marked out on the ground. I'm nearly finished, well, you've got a few more to do. And this is the magnetometer on the end of that cone. And then these are the readings I get. This big reading up here is because the metal of the rig. And then as it comes back down to the natural ground, there's not a reading. There's a little blip there. That little blip is purely because there's a little bit of rubbish in the ground. And then it does it all automatically. Look, you, you sit out much and force you want to use. And then in it goes, it just lifts up like that. And as it lifts up like that, it'll start pushing down. And then I have to keep an eye on this tonnage force. I have to make sure there's no big lines coming there. If there was a big line, I'd push the stop button. There's nothing there, it's boring. There's straight jobs, there's the cone there, which is under the ground there. And then I pick up another rod in a second, that's come across on to the bit of metal on. Put it on, push the button, it does it again. And then this is the machine outside, look. It's a lovely little machine, isn't it? It's, it's wonderful. 360,000 euros of air. Uh, a toy that they let me play with. It's good, isn't it? And what would make it even better, what would make it even better is if you could put Daisy on here. That'd be great, wouldn't it? Anyway, that's what I do. I'm going to carry on doing it.